Hi everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today after the morning walk, I plan to make something different for breakfast. So today I'm going to make potato roti. It's curry filling roti. We can choose any curry for this roti. So let's go to the video. For making potato roti, first I'm going to use 14 g yeast. and 1 teaspoon sugar mix with the warm water and keep aside for 10 minutes until it rise well For making the dough, I am going to use plain flour, 800 gram plain flour. Around 1 teaspoon salt and 1 tablespoon oil, I am using sunflower oil. The yeast mix size rice well. Now I am going to add this one to the flour then start to make the dough. Now I am adding some warm water The dough need more water so I am adding more water Dough is ready now. Top of the dough, spray some oil. Cover this one with the plate or paper for half an hour. After half an hour later, the dough is rice well. Now I can start to make the roti. I am always using my cutting board to roll the doughs. So first spread some plain flour. Then make the small balls. Make the dough very thin and keep the curry in the middle. Here I use potato and fish. You can use any curry filling. Now close the curry with the dough like this very carefully. Finally Press the middle area very carefully, sometime the curry will come out. Now heat the pan and spray some oil, then take the roti very carefully and start to make. Every time turn it to the other side.
Again, spray some oil top of the roti. One side is almost cooked. Now turn it to other side. The curry filling is same. I'm using to the pastries, spring roll and samosa. Don't use the roller very hard because the curry will come out. Cook both sides, importantly the edges, if you don't it will taste like dough. Potato roti is ready now. You can make this one for breakfast or dinner. It was quick and easy and really yummy. Enjoy the day. Stay safe. Please subscribe to my channel.